Hi guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. In the last few videos, a lot of you have been asking about my haircut. So I want to clarify on that first and then we'll move on to the real video. Okay, so my haircut is basically it's U-shaped from front and from back it's V-shaped. So I think that's the whole story about it. If you'll tell your uh, person in the salon, I think they will get it. Okay, coming back to the video, I know in the past few videos I've shown you little bit of how I take my own photos but still I was getting a lot of questions and you guys were really confused about how you can take your own photos so what I have decided to do is that in this video I'll be showing you everything like from A to Z how I take my own photos and that too without tripod and yeah there are a few jugards which I have come up with myself and I want to share everything with you all also as you can see the whole house is a mess Sara Saman idhar udhar rakha hua hai but still that does not mean that you can't have really cool photos for yourself and one more thing which I wanted to share is that a lot of you say that we have this phone, hai, ye phone hai, we don't have a really good equipment but I'll tell you the magic trick which is applicable in any phone and kah kahi pe bhi photos le rahe, it's going to work for you okay for example um, the main source of lighting is this window for me right now. So if I'm the opposite side, so as you can see, the lighting is not very good. But suddenly, when the lighting is directly on my face, pe aare, you guys are able to see me clearly. So similarly, if you're taking photos, so you can see where the main lighting source is coming from. And you don't stand opposite to it. If the lighting is coming from your face, pe aare, then it's going to make a huge, huge difference. So yeah, keeping that in mind, let's get started with the video. For the first photo, I'm making the best use out of a wall. I have just placed the phone covering a little bit of wall also as it looks very cool to add some fun element to your photos. As I have no one to click my photos, so I have set my camera on self timer for 3 seconds. Don't try too hard on your posing guys, just do whatever feels right. Also make sure that you're wearing something comfortable so you can just be yourself while shooting. And this is what I have got out of this fun little shoot that I just did at the corner of my house. I'm loving it so much but you guys tell me how are you liking this one. Next jugaad is just amazing you guys. For that I have used one container and a banana <laughs> to give my phone some support. Now please don't roast me in comments you guys. We have to do these things to get good photos when we have no one. Again put phone on self timer and click as many pictures as you can. And this is the result. Love how it has turned out. This trick is great to click some really good photos from low angles. Next photo includes a chair and a pillow. I'm just placing the pillow on chair and slowly resting my phone on that and there you go. Now you just have to give your best. Choose the best angle for yourself and oh, do not forget to keep in mind the lighting too. And this is the final result. Love how calm this looks. No one can tell the efforts which went behind taking this one. For the next one, I'm using the window next to my bed. So I have just placed my phone between my bed and a wall and it's just literally kind of hanging in between. Make sure to click a lot of photos so that later you have options to choose from. And this is what I got. Can't believe I have clicked this by myself. Makes me want to pat myself at back and say, Good job, Sonia. I'm proud of you. So as I told you how the whole house is kind of a mess and so is my closet but I'm making the best use out of it by resting my phone on my clothes and I'm spreading few of my favorite tops here and there. And now you can click your standing photos. And 
and this is what I got. When you have no one to click your photos, make the best use out of what's available just right in front of you. And lastly, I'm taking a selfie by using one more phone in my other hand in sun and I'm trying to create a reflection of it on my face. You can even use a used CD if you have one at home. This option is great to be creative with your selfies. And this is what I got. Also guys, how I edit my photos wali bhi video is in description box so do not forget to check that out. So guys, that was it for today's video and in this video I have shared my heart and I think the most fun way to come up with good pictures is to create your own jugar, you know, to have your own creative juices flowing and come up with some really cool fun poses. Let me know too if you have a very different and koi you know, unique sa jugaad nikal kar aata hai. Do not forget to share those with me because I am your friend. Agar main aapke saath sab share karti ho, I really want you all to share with me your tricks as well. And do not forget to share your pictures with me on Instagram using hashtag Sonians Recreate. Also, mujhe na DM mat karna because your pictures will get lost between so many DMs, like other DMs. So what you can do is you can simply tag me in your stories and I will repost them on my profile. So yeah, waiting for your photos and yeah, I love कोई और extra tips share करना मत भूलना and if you enjoyed watching it make sure that you subscribe to my channel like this video and I'll see you in my next one bye